the Chicago Blackhawks have not qualified for the postseason since the shortened 2019-2020 regular season, when they won the play-in round against the Edmonton Oilers before losing in the first round to the Vegas Golden Knights. After a rebuild which saw most of its stars leave for greener pastures, the Blackhawks have positioned themselves as a team to watch during the upcoming season. With the third worst points total in the league, the Blackhawks had an 11.5% chance of landing the number one pick, trailing the Columbus Blue Jackets and Anaheim Ducks for the best odds. On May 8th at the NHL Entry Draft Lottery, the Blackhawks beat the odds and took home the number one pick, winning the lottery for the second time in team history and first since 2007 when they selected Patrick Kane. Heading into the opening of free agency, the Blackhawks were in an envious position with around 50% of their cap space available. However, this would present a different set of cap problems as the Hawks needed to spend roughly $20 million in contracts to reach the cap floor. The first domino fell on June 8th when Chicago extended center Andreas Athanasiu on a two-year contract worth $8.5 million, followed shortly by a trade that would see defenseman Ian Mitchell and Alec Regula go to the Boston Bruins in exchange for veteran forwards Nick Foligno and Taylor Hall. After the trade was completed, Foligno would sign a one-year contract worth $4 million for the Blackhawks, who added $10 million in total contracts with the trade. Another trade a few days later would see veteran forward Josh Bailey and a 2026 second-round pick sent to Chicago from the New York Islanders for future considerations. And in a corresponding move, Chicago bought out the contract of Bailey, adding a shade over 4% of his contract to their books. On the same day, the Blackhawks would send a 2024 seventh-round pick to the Tampa Bay Lightning for winger Corey Perry, signing the veteran to a one-year extension worth $4 million. With the first selection in the NHL draft, the Blackhawks selected 18-year-old phenom Connor Bedard from the WHL. Bedard was a unanimous number one prospect in a deep draft, drawing comparisons to Connor McDavid and Sidney Crosby. Bedard is the complete package with an elite shot and incredible hands that complements his agility and vision as a skater, and is a lock to be in the starting lineup on opening night for the Blackhawks. Bedard was not the only selection of the night, as the Hawks also held the 19th overall pick and used it to select center Oliver Moore from the USA men's U18 team. Moore is slightly undersized for the NHL, but projects as a top six forward in the league, mainly due to his elite skating ability. Chicago still needs a lot of talent to surround Bedard, ideally adding a top young forward with size at some point, but the arrow certainly is pointing up for this original six franchise. I'm Dennis Moorhead with Inside the Rink.